In this video I will tell you the story of how I came up with Non, why I decided to change my artist name two times and in the end I will reveal my face. This video took me months to make, so please watch the video till the end, not only to support me but to understand the full context of my story. I hope you enjoy. Let's rewind time. January 2020. I wanted to change my artist name. I wasn't satisfied with the artist name Virtual Max. Why? Let's rewind time even more. In 2018 I was at my friend's place making some music and just hanging around, you know. And uh, I wasn't satisfied with my artist name, Maxwell Music, cause most people always thought of a German rapper called Maxwell from the German rapper group 187. But I actually got called Maxwell from a best friend while playing soccer when I was 12, so that's where I got that name from. Anyway, I wanted to change it quick, so I saw Paul Robinson releasing a new track with his new side project called Virtual Self. I'm a big fan of Pardo Robinson since 2010, so I thought Virtual South, Virtual Right. I think there's some place for a third virtual. Pretty dumb idea because I also released Melodic Dubstep. <laughs> I also released a track called You Said with the famous Virtual Right vocals. You said never let me go. Since then I was the virtual right copy in the community. And because I didn't want to be like Crow, <laughs> JK, JK, love ya. I wanted to change my artist name. I started collecting many name ideas until one night. The Edgeless Night. The conversation started on 4th of January 2020 at 12.45 am. I don't like virtual max anymore. Okay. So what things do you find cool? Agenus responded. Um, aesthetic, cute things, graffiti, anime, and... starry skies. Then I would say, take inspiration from anime stuff and cute things. After that, I told him about my potential artist name list. At 1.14am we finally started brainstorming. Around 1.30 am I had some ideas, including non. But wait, what name finding techniques did I use? Of course combining words or things that I like, but also random typing on my keyboard and reversing words and sentences. It's getting a bit crazy now, but here's how I came up with the name non. There was one sentence I loved to say back then to my school friends. I may look fly. But I want to die. I reversed that sentence, took the T, removed the T and added an N. Boom! Non. But at this point I hadn't made my decision. So we brainstormed even more. 3 AM. Agents went to bed and I spent 30 minutes on drawing test banners for my top 3 names. Those were of course basic sketches, for example I plan to make the non-banner in 3D and with glowing outlines. But I can't do that in paint. XD! After that I went to bed as well. 24 days later. I drew more versions of the non-banner in class cause I really like the name. Another 2 days later I started drawing some stuff on my PC and another 3 days later I was finally done. As you can see, I didn't choose the 3D font or glow and went for a more graffiti based look. On 5th of February it was finally time. I launched Non with my Potter Robinson Get Your Wish remix, which I made in 7 days. Thanks to Lyric Wolf for the MIDI again, I was so lucky. Of course, the time was a bit stressful, but was it worth it? Yes. But you may ask yourself, wait a second, where's that little white guy with grey eyes? Hmm, very good question. Maybe it was in your wardrobe at the side. To understand how the non character was created, we have to move forward in the story. It started out when I met an internet friend for the first time, which inspired me to create my track I Really Like You. I wanted to make something special for the artwork, 
So I drew me and her. Vibing. Anyways, as you might notice, the shape of the character is pretty similar to Norn. But what happened next? So basically a guy called Dawson Valentine, I call him the art guy, wanted to support smaller producers and offered me an interview. Oh snap, I never took part in the interview. But for that he needed a couple of things including a logo, but I had no logo. Then I had the idea to just turn this character white and give him grey eyes. And boom, the character was officially created. As you can see, this idea came very spontaneously and there was no spectacular meaning behind Norn. Yet, the question who is Norn and who I want to be as an artist were more present than ever. I found answers to this question over time, especially when I made my different EP. Let me try to explain who Norn is after this whole journey. Who is Norn? H1. Gender. Male. Species. We don't know, he can fly though. Norn was created through its artist's creativity in February 2020. He likes to make music about stories, people and his feelings. His goal is to awake certain emotions with his music. In his different EP he showed two types of his personality. Moonlight stands for the emotional and dreamy side of his personality. Fly Away stands for the cute and kawaii side of his personality. And Different combines those two sides of his personality. He tries to express that being different and having unusual character traits is totally fine. Ok guys, now I told you the story behind Norn. I think it's time for my face reveal. This video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Led. What's up guys, this is Norn. For those who don't know me, I'm Max, I'm 19 years old and I'm trying to become a full-time music artist. I live near Aachen, that's a city in Germany. I asked some of you guys on Twitter and Instagram for questions so I can talk a bit in this video. So let's start with the first question. Nistrad asks what was the first track you've ever made, if you remember? Oh, I remember. The first thing that I've ever made was at my brother's PC when I was 12 and it sounds like this. My first full track that I've made was called Mystery and I made it with my best friend back then and it took me around 5 hours or so and this is how it sounds like What's your nationality? As I already said I'm German and I don't drink a lot of beer or alcohol but I do like pretzels <laughs> Chicken Beats aka Arinity asks Dream Collab. I would say Paper Skies or Tokyo Machine. I mean, I love Potter Robinson stuff, but I think my style is more combinable with those two artists. Grünes Geschlüpp asks Why aren't you a gangster rapper? Fun fact. I am. <laughs> I released a diss track three years ago. To be fair, it wasn't that serious, but it was also very cringe. Hazoko, uh, I hope I spelled your name right, asks, why are you such an amazing artist? First of all, thank you so much, but I think I can't answer that question because it's super subjective. But if I have to, I would say, because of my creativity. Okay, that's it, but one important thing, uh, I made a Discord server, uh, first link in the description. Okay, that's it for the video. Thank you so much for watching, thank you so much for supporting my music, 
supporting me as an artist and yeah, see ya next time. Bye. <laughs> Chicken Beats aka Arinity asks Dream Collab. I would say Paper Skies or Arin. <laughs> Chicken Beats aka Rendity asks Dream Collab. I would say Paper Skies or Tokyo Machine because the style would fit. <laughs> Chicken Beats aka Rendity asks Dream Collab. I would say pa 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 Paper Skies. <laughs>